man 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 all right so hold on let me get rid of this all right um first and foremost this uh i'm liking the river i'm liking the river man um i gotta be honest it looks it looks good it looks good i am impressed with the rivers i like the fact that um as they continue to develop the game they're working on tools that will help them automate things especially uh when they mentioned when they spoke about the uh the automatic uh, distribution system that they were talking about when they wanted to populate um along the rivers the right item the right items to um in terms of fauna in terms of i mean in terms of flora and, and whatnot um in a way that it makes sense um being alongside of a river and also the fact that they also mentioned um you could in the future you could you could literally put something on the river and it will flow down the river i don't think i've seen a game that does anything like that that's crazy it's like they're just trying to take it to the next level you know it's uh it's it's a really cool tech man so it seems like uh 317 will be the test bed for it, just to see it and um i i i did a video recently i think yesterday and i went, when i was talking about this is going to be big because they need to test this in they need to have this in before pyro uh reason being is i'm sure there's planets or moons on pyro that probably has water um and they're probably gonna have rivers and oceans and things of that nature as well as lava fields and and things like that it's gonna use the same tech for lava fields so you know um i could see why they want this in um at this point it's a it's a good and it seemed like they even wanted to have this thing in p16 but uh they weren't happy with how it was uh how it, the state it was at that time and they decided to hold it back so um not all the time when they hold things back it's necessarily means that they're not working on anything it's just that they probably want it um out in a better state as opposed to um a buggy state you know what i mean um the fact that you can walk underwater i don't know how i feel about it but it's cool <laughs> you can walk out underwater without uh drowning is interesting I don't know, like, should it? Space helmets are amphibious. I don't know, man. I don't know if it makes sense to me. Like, you guys let me know in the comments if it makes sense to you for, to be able to walk under, under, under the river. Cause I can see a lot of guys just standing on the river, just having conversations. <laughs> it's not going to make sense to me. Um, I like the fact that you, the grab legs, gloves can, uh, go on top of it i could i could see myself uh, i could see the org doing some races on on at the river itself you know this is going to be uh it's going to be a, a cool site to be at um yeah the fact that they're they're also putting resources where you can actually actually retrieve um edibles and things like that as well that's really cool man i like i like that i really like it um I, I'm seeing progress on it. little by Without little, right? Sync. We're seeing progress uh, with, it's not more so gameplay, but, uh, you know, we want some more gameplay, CIG. <laughs> um, so they also they also went, went through um, the reputation system, how they're updating it in such a way where um, even if you do shoot somebody that's actually friendly to you, you don't necessarily immediately go red. Um, it's, it's a big issue, especially during Xeno Threat where it can actually ruin your experience man it, even even it, hopefully it will go to the point where um even the bunker missions when you accidentally shoot one of the securities by accident you know I, hopefully they could also extend it to that point you know because it kind of ruins the experience it swings you over to the other side of the law and then you literally have no other gameplay loops to go through when you're a pirate it, it kind of sucks you know you know so that's 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 uh um yeah i'm liking I'm liking the fact that they're updating it um whereby you'll you'll build more reputation based on 
your standings with each faction it'll automatically you'll, you'll be friendly towards them when you come across them like for example the nine tails if you run into them they'll they'll be okay with you if you have enough credit if you have enough affinity with them i think that's a cool idea um i think it's a really good idea i like it i like that the same thing with ue if you're a pirate like i could i like the fact that uh pirates can't really come around stations anymore and troll you because security will just immediately go after them immediately without you know even if they get rid of their crime stats i think they'll still go after them you know i think that's how it's uh you know oh okay so it's, okay okay so the pressure suit nasa astronauts uh practice spacewalk missions in pools underwater okay okay all right cool yeah, yeah so that's essentially uh my thoughts on and it of course with additional uh, that's 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 my thoughts on it um leave a comment you know what your thoughts on on this this uh, episode of inside star citizen subscribe if you haven't already and um we'll see you on the next one